Zika virus made its way into the headlines in the last couple of years. This is an infection that is transmitted by mosquitoes. The main problem with infection with Zika virus is for women who are pregnant. Uh, infants who are born to mothers who become infected with Zika virus during their pregnancy can have various neurodevelopmental problems. One of the most striking features is an abnormally small brain and head. People can be concerned about traveling to areas where Zika virus is in transmission. If you're concerned about Zika transmission in an area where you may be traveling, it's important to visit the Centers for Disease Control website, which gives the latest up-to-date information on transmission of Zika, both in the United States and other areas of the world. Again, people most at risk for having a serious consequence of Zika virus infection are pregnant women because the babies can become severely affected. Zika virus infection is rarely associated with a neurological condition called Guillain-Barre, but this is infrequent. Most people who become infected with Zika virus will just have a nonspecific fever rash illness. You should avoid traveling to Zika virus infected areas if you are pregnant or plan to become pregnant. Additionally, if you are the spouse of a woman who intends to become pregnant, you too should uh, proceed with caution when traveling to Zika virus infected areas. Talk to your healthcare provider if you have any concerns about the area where you are traveling and Zika virus infection.